Hello everybody, I'm Mo that was and this is Dishonored Ones again. I went and turned on the water and now you better be giving me back my engine coil, Nurse Trimble. It's nursey, nursey man. I don't think you'll see your men again. The code is four zero eight. Four oh eight. That's the code. Now the code opens up the thingamadoo that's got the thingy in it. And it's not over here. That's downstairs. That's where I'll find that thingamadoo that I need. And now the mill is running. They don't need the engine coil because water is working properly because somebody went and fixed the plumbing. They could have hired a plumber, but nope, they hired a professional assassin to do it. That's one way of getting the job done. Now I'll just yoink that coil. Chunk of metal wiring. Yep. Closer to Delilah's throat. So be it. Yeah. Got the thing. Now we go back to the boat. What are you looking at? What are you looking at? And what are you Get doing? Me, Would you mind not getting in my way? I really want to murder you right now, but I don't feel like dealing with the bullshit and problems that come from all the other guys just from taking care of one little asshole. Sometimes people just get to get away with small things. And that's all there is to it. If I could just get out of here, there we go. A few concussions later, I have made it out. No fighting. Wonder how long that'll last. Probably not long at all. People tend to get mad over stupid bullshit all the time. And then people get shot. That's just the way it works. Now let's just plug the thing in and be on the way. And witches, of course, can't just be going things the way they need to be. Come on, witch bitch, you're going over here. You sleep there and them. Uh, yeah, that hurts. Apparently, friendly fire is a thing. And... Oh, wait, that's Lizzie. I was just about to choke Lizzie. That would have been bad. And I don't want to go in there and start swinging at the rats because I might hit somebody I'm not supposed to hit. Please, get the honors down. Fire up the engine from the bridge. Someone wants to get kicked Alright then. The, now that the witches are gone, just let's go off to the brig or manor. And also off to the final mission in the DLC. As soon as it loads, we'll be there in the Brigmore Manor. The Brigmores were an ancient family, bankrupted a generation ago. Since then, the manor has housed two street gangs, a smuggling ring, innumerable rats, and the Brigmore witches. I'd always left them alone, but now a painter named Delilah had taken up witchcraft and formed a coven. She was trying something. Yes, A ritual. Something. But what kind? The kind the of ritual needs knows. to be stopped. I cannot abide a mystery. Didn't he say I cannot abide a mystery to Corvo when right before he threw all his shit down into that hole? Hmm. Well, I don't feel like getting any of these. These favors. I don't need them. All I need is a handful of sleepy darts and choke dust. I know how choke dust works! There! Yeah, I wanna stop making purchases. 
I scouted, sir. They've locked the front, and I've seen evidence of snares. Also, maybe it's nothing. But I spotted several statues of the woman Delilah. Mm -hmm. I don't know what it means, but I thought it was worth mentioning. It means trouble. Anything else? They're getting in and out of the house somehow, but I haven't spotted it. Sorry, sir. Best I can do. Good enough. I'll take it from here. All right. And this right here, that dog skull, is gone. That is a grave hound. If I were to walk past it, it would materialize a big old dog body and then it would try to kill me. And then I'd knock it the fuck out and it would get right back up over and over again until I smashed the skull. And I saved myself some pain in the ass. Why did it not perch me up on that wood like it's supposed to? But like I was saying, saved myself some ass pain by destroying that skull before it had a chance to even get up. And I need to find a way into this mansion. And it would seem that way has been found. And them's some grave hounds over there. I can slaughter them all I want, and it does not count towards the chaos rating because they're already dead. I ain't taking the lives of some innocent animals. These are walking corpses is what they is. Animated by some dark magic. Clever whereabouts. With that on his way, Delilah had me disable the grave switch and put it in the garden shed. S. Well, that's a very convenient thing to be leaving around for a certain person whose name just happens to be Dowd to go findin'. Now, maybe I can find a way into this thing if I could just see. No matter. I don't need to get in that way. There are other ways in, like squirming along the ledge here. Yeah, that's a way of getting in. That is indeed a way of getting in. And this thing has a habit of not perching me on top of things that I'm supposed to be perched on top of when I go teleporting to them. There. Better. Now, if you would be so kind as to not go overshooting my perching things again, that would be nice. Garden sheds that way. And that's where I'm going. I just need to not be killed along the way, which should not be a problem if I just stay out of sight. The sixth stricture. Okay, that's the thing about the overseers. They follow those seven strictures, I believe it is. I believe there's seven of them. And page from an old book. Dear Dreary Water's hissing daughters, crack three green shells and steal their pearls. Turn the spigot and drink from the misery of a broken house. Gulp and swallow, follow, follow. Three wet marbles down the gullet. Do this for me, dearie, and I'll give you a birthday gift. And that's how I get another rune, which I'm probably not gonna do. I just kill river crusts, steal their pearls, and then swallow those pearls with some water from this place. That's what it's saying to do. Eep, choke dust. That will be very useful if I happen to blunder into a witch, which I might end up doing if I am not careful. Now, I just need to slip inside the manor. And I believe there's a back door around here and another way in involving that thing in the garden shed. Or is there a back door? I don't remember. I do not remember whether or not there is a back door. Curse my memory failing me in the ripe old age of 25. Old age comes for us all. I'm a crotchety old bastard. Still living with his parents and all that happy horse shit. There goes my kneecaps. Now 
Uh, let's get to that shed, shall we? And guard the shed. We have reached the shed completely undetected. Except maybe by a grave hound that didn't get a good enough look at me to know exactly where I was. And was there another river crust here or just something falling off the ceiling? No matter. I'm just gonna steal your pearl. Yeah, there we go. And I don't feel like doing Granny's spell. I don't need no runes. I just need that. That heavy lever. Now, now that I got that, I gotta go back to that thing that had the empty lever socket. And I could probably get up on the roof of the estate from here. Poof. Whoa. There's people here. Hmm. And is that a way in that I see? Why do you obsess about that butler and his Now there might that might be a way in. Uh, maybe not. Maybe not a way inside, but a way to slip around undetected. Either way works. And that graveyard thing is a hidden entrance to this manor. Do not slide off the roof. Why did you go sliding off the roof when I told you exactly not to do that? I'm pretty sure that front door's locked. Someone should be here. And I can't really go in through the front door. They'll be expecting that. If you're trying to sneak into someplace, it's not the best idea to go using the front goddamn door. The best way in is through the hidden graveyard entrance. That is just a rule in any burglary, heist, or assassination, anything that involves sneaking into the place. Always best to use the hidden graveyard entrance. And there we go. Don't you come here, Mr. Doggy Dog. I ain't got time for your bullshit. That's right, you you look directly at me and fail to notice me. There we go. I'm in equipped. Wee! And yoink. And I'm going to avoid that Delilah statue. Because the Delilah statues in this mission function as security cameras. Once you walk in front of them, they go like, Ugh, I see you. And then every witch in a thousand mile radius starts crawling up your ass. Now that I am inside, I gotta find Delilah. And I thought the flooded district was run down. And find out her plan and put a stop to it. Don't know why there's a marker guiding me to the exit. Because I don't need the exit. I need to be in here and take down some witch bitches. That's what I need. You take a nap now. And, all right, there's no big hole in the floor for you to fall through and break your neck. Now, I'm sure if I wander around, I'll stumble into something or overhear a conversation that they don't want me hearing. Delilah's musings, I worked in my studio until late last night and completed the painting of Emily. When Dowd kidnapped her, I was terrified that he might already know what I was planning, but it seems I overestimated him. He turned her over to the conspirators. What a fool! Once young Emily assumes the throne, I'll already be looking out of those lovely brown eyes. That is a clue to her plan. What could it mean that she's going to be looking out through Emily's eyes? I already know, but have you figured it out yet? You're smart people, you can figure it out. You don't need me spelling all this shenanigans out for you. I did not want to do that. And you take a nap. Alright. Did you drown in your sleep? Nope. Good. 
Just got a little bit of water in your lungs. A nice, non-lethal amount of water filling your lungs as you take a nap in this water. And I'm gonna put you in the dry bricks. Much more comfortable. It'll lead to back problems down the road. But that's your problem. As long as I ain't accidentally murdering you, that's what I care about. And... Come on, there we go, turn you off. Now, let's see. Where, oh, where, where, oh, where is the thing I need to find? And there's also whale oil tanks here. With things that are going to shoot at and explode them. If I stumble into the traps. Very clever trap setups they got here. She's alone. What if something goes wrong? Who will help her? Doesn't it worry you? It you underestimate me an idea. great lady's resourcefulness. She is not alone. Not entirely. The statues. Of course. They're more than statues. She's put her will in them. And in the void, their power is much greater. Do not fret, sweet Tilda. Lady Delilah needs you to be strong and steadfast. This is no time to wilt like a summer daisy. I won't. Forgive me, sister. You're right. Yeah. So watch out for the statues. And... Yeah. That's about all I got from that, is watch out for the statues. <sighs> and there's something that I need to grab that's over in the opposite side of the mansion. And that will allow me to actually reach Delilah. Oh, there you are. You just teleported or something. Because you can do that. Because you's a witch. Who's taking a nice nap. And I believe that that note on the table will point me in the right direction. Brunhilde came to me last night while I was in my studio in the West Wing, finishing the ritual painting of young Lady Emily. She informed me that one of our girls allowed herself to get caught and interrogated at Coldridge Prison. Nevertheless, it seems Dowd is oblivious to my plans. Clearly that was written some time ago, and did not give me the clue that I thought it would. That it did not. But the West, other than the West Wing part of the clue, that's where I will find an object of great importance that will allow me to reach Delilah and put a stop to her insidious plans. West Wing's over there. All I gotta do is follow the markers and hopefully not get spotted along the way. Simple as that it is. It is very simple, my children. You didn't drown in your sleep yet, did you? Good. You sleep in dry grass, dirt, bricks, whatever the hell that is that I just threw you down in. And let's make sure that I ain't about to be found. I like not being found. Being found would be bad for my plans to stop Delilah's plans from being plans that come to fruition. Hmm. They seem to be talking about the things that I have done. Well then, I believe I heard something that I don't like the sound of. Now, okay, I'm going to perch here on this bookshelf. No better, nobody better go spotting me from here. Good. West Wing's over that way. I'm gonna head in there, get the thing, and put a stop to Delilah once and for all in the next episode, because I'm all out of time for this one, so thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching. See you in the next one. Yeah.